dream. Long time ago, she had a dream. A dream of joy, a dream of happiness, a dream she calls life. And in that very same dream, a figure appears. His soul is deeply lost, yet his flesh is there before her. She does not know his name, but she knows his heart. His eyes are darkened with fear. He dares to think that he might someday slay her. He dares that thought sadly, though. She shan't imagine how a human being could think such a thing. She shan't trust any more of any honor ever. She knows that she will someday come to an end. She knows what life is really made of, and she knows that it is not made up of materialistic things. Life is made like a bird sailing in the wind through rough storms and smooth skies, a lonely yet thoughtful thing that she still never understood completely. She can only say that life is not a rose filled with smells of great perfumes. Life is not a king that is blessed with great wishes and wealth. Life is a dandelion, many times mistaken for a dainty flower, but is against all of your expectations. It will force out all signs of hope. Life is like a present, never knowing if the last meal you have might just as well be the last. Life will choke you, just like the sickness you have had ever since the day you were born. She truthfully does not know what life is. Tell her all you university men, all you kings and queens. Tell her all you dukes and duchesses, all you lords and ladies. Tell her, for she is just a pebble in the rough road of life.